We are therefore constrained on this development to state that I may compromise the integrity of this election even before the coalition began at the, PU, at the PUs. I repeat, we are therefore constrained on this development to state that I may compromise the integrity of the election even before the coalition began at the polling units. We have therefore arrived at the conclusion that the presidential election of Saturday, February 25, 2023, conducted by Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, under the leadership of Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, has been irretriev irretrievably compromised. <coughs> and we have totally lost faith in the entire process. The People's Democratic Party, Labour Party, ADC, and all other aligned parties shall not be part of the process currently going on at the National Coalition Center. 146,977. Gombe, two different states. APC have also 146,977. PDP in Bauchi has 319,123. PDP in Gombe has 319,123. <laughs> Labour Party has 26,000. In, in Bauchi, they have 26,160. In Gombe, they also have 26,160. It is very clear that these results were allocated, deliberately allocated. And funny enough, this type of uh, mischief, uh, they, they didn't do it good enough. And you can see how two separate states, far away, uh, the parties cause exactly the same numbers in, the in, in two different states. In two different states. coming up, and for the fact that people are gathered here and we're talking in this manner, it shows that uh, a lot of question marks have been raised. And there is every need that these issues are addressed in the way and manner that were presented so that Nigerians will eventually accept the results of the elections as the will of the people. We're not asking for anything extraordinary. We're asking that we lay down rules that have been set out to be followed in total and to the latter. Thank you.